the butterfly story began for me before so many years ago. Maybe it is the same time when the di director was beginning to dreaming about the story. Because in one of our discussion, he was telling me during we were talking about life and some some things about you know not not some interesting things, but during this discussion, he just stopped me and he told me about uh, this movie. He said me, I am dreaming to write uh, a story of two poem poet which were living in 1940s. And I feel that you have an energy to be the girl of that movie. Suzanne, she's a 18 years old girl living in a wealthy family, daughter of a wealthy family, and uh, she's so innocent and she's a lucky girl who had a connection with life that she took everything from life without paying any cost. But for her to meet with these two incredible, talented poets is changing her life. I can say that for Susan, there's two milestones. I mean, there's a milestone for her life that before Muzaffer and Rüştü and after Muzaffer and Rüştü, because he gets mm, faced with the reality of life and more deepness of life and the patient for, the, when, he, when she faced with the patient of these two poets, that they have for writing, uh, she, she began to discover first, I can say that her individual character, because she was just 18 and uh, she was just at the beginning of discovering the life. And after that, she began that suffering is related to the deepness of life with these two poets, which makes her feel more deep in this case because before for her the life was so easy she was a beautiful flower of that city until she met with these poets and after that everything changed and i have to say that during this shooting process we had a lot of miracles such as uh, after one week of shooting our director uh, invited us to his room he was asking us about the relation uh, about our relation with poem, poems and during that meeting at the end of that meeting we realized that the window is full of butterflies Yilmaz has very intimate feeling with these two poems and I felt in every single second that they were with us during the shootings and this the spiritual part of the movie makes whole story more deep and I, I realized at the end of the day I realized that if as an artist you are doing a signature to a life even you, you think that nobody heard about it if it is really worth for the world to hear it will be one day maybe after 70 years but it will it will reach the people actually it was my most weird day for the butterflies dream shooting. I felt from two days before Ahmed, who is playing my father, was coming to me and saying some words with full of love. And he was trying to persuade me to, to trust him, which I was already trusting him. But And he was always telling me about, you know, this is movie and Maybe sometimes we can broke some heart, but at the end, it is just for the, for the art. I said, okay. <laughs> and I felt that Yilmaz and Ahmed was discussing a lot about this. They were, I was thinking that they are gossiping about some, something that they don't want us to know. At the end, that moment came and he just told me, are, do you trust me? I said, yes, of course. Okay, just leave yourself to me. And the scene began, we were walking in the corridor and he just turned to me and slapped me. You know, as an as a <laughs> actor, there is an animal inside. And my animal was so happy and satisfied at that moment because I knew that this was so real. And all my goal as an actress to make the things real, I was so happy. But just we continued to walk 
And when we were out of the camera, I looked and Ahmed was, Ahmed was crying at that moment. And I was trying to tell him that, don't worry, you know, I'm so happy, it was so real. So <laughs> there's nothing to be worried about. I feel, uh, I love this kind of tricks in cinema. This makes, this kind of tricks, I believe that make this illusion much more rich and much more exciting, much more fascinating. And this is one of the story I will never forget. Uh, I love that feeling that the director was playing with me. Ne tanrıdan haber, ne dallarda meyve, ne kucak açar hatıralar, ne de dönerler gemiler bir de. Before, if you will tell me this, I can say that I can live without poems. But this movie makes me discover that the poems in all around, just when we want, when when we are aware to see, when we are. Um, really able to see, we can feel that every moment is so poetic, not only the poems. <laughs>